hello friends so today i am going to solve lead code daily challenge okay so the problem name is coco eating bananas so let's read the problem coco loves to eat bananas there are n piles of bananas the eighth pile has piles i bananas okay so the problem statement is very clear so there are n piles which is given in the form of vector okay and piles of i will contain uh, the number that denotes the number of bananas present in that pile okay the guards have gone and will come back in h hours so there is given another integer which is h which denotes the number of hours available to you okay so coco can decide her bananas per hour eating speed of k so what k denotes here is in one hour how much bananas he can eat okay each hour she chooses some piles of bananas and eats k bananas from that pile so in a given hour he decides to choose any particular pile and then he eats k bananas from it and also if the pile has less than k bananas she eats all of them and will not eat any more bananas during this hour okay so what means here is that uh, sorry let's suppose uh, in one hour coco can eat three bananas okay and in a particular pile okay let's suppose the zeroth pile has two bananas two bananas and he can eat three bananas per hour so in the given hour he will eat only two bananas but he will not eat any other banana in this hour so not eat any other banana in this hour okay so it is very clear now coco likes to eat slowly but still wants to finish eating all bananas before the guards return so what you can understand from here is he has to eat all the bananas okay all the bananas before the guards come okay it means that in the given h hours in this given h hours he wants to eat all the bananas okay so return the minimum integer k such that she can eat all the bananas within h hours so now we will see uh, given a piles vector and also h equal to 8 we will see how the answer 4 is coming it means that how in 4 uh, bananas eating per hour he can eat all these bananas okay now see so in this i give the index number so as you can see in the zeroth index the number of bananas present in this pile is three and so on okay in the one th index the number of bananas present in the pile are six now we have to decide an integer k such that uh, the number of hours required to eat all these bananas is less than it okay so let's suppose so k is equal to 4 k is equal to 4 so answer here is k equal to 4 we will check for if what would happen if k is equal to 3 okay so let's now die run 3 6 7 11 in the first hour first hour let's suppose uh, coco is in this pile okay as you can see here the k is less than equal to the number of bananas present in the zeroth index okay so here three bananas he will eat in the first hour okay so one hour is gone one hour is taken to eat these three bananas now when he comes to this pile he looks that there are six bananas now 
6 modulo k is equal to equal to 0 so here he, he will take 2 hours to eat the piles from these bananas now 7 as you can see 7 modulo k not equal to 0 okay because 7 modulo 3 is equal to 1 okay so number of hours required to fully eat this piles is, is equal to 3 as he will eat 6 bananas in 2 hours okay and remaining 1 banana from this pile from one uh, from one this pile he will take another hour to it okay because as you can see here it is given that if the pile has less than k bananas she eats all of them instead and will not eat any more bananas during this hour okay so it is very clear and then when it comes to this pile that is 11 so 11 modulo k is not equal to 0 okay so 11 by 3 which is 3 11 by 3 is 3 according to our uh, division in program okay or integer division you can tell and we will require another one hour to eat that two bananas okay what this two is coming because 11 modulo 3 is, is equal to 2 i hope you understand and so the number of hours required to eat this pile is 4 so as you can see if you sum this you are requiring 10 hours okay 10 hours to eat this whole vector of uh, what you can say bananas okay now if i let's uh, see if i choose k equal to 4 okay which is the answer so let's see what is the scenario in that case so just one second okay so my array was 3 6 7 11 okay now with k equal to 4 what k represents the number of bananas in an hour he can eat okay so now in the first hour or uh, when he is in this pile so number of bananas present in this pile is 3 so he will take only one hour to finish this pile okay so one hour he is taking to finish this pile because this 3 is less than k 3 is less than k and k is, is equal to 4 so he will only one hour he will take to finish this pile now when he goes to this pile which is 6 so 6 modulo k is not equal to 0 and 6 by k is, is equal to 1 okay according to integer division and he will take another one hour to eat those two bananas which is re remaining okay and 6 modulo k is, is equal to 2 here okay 6 modulo 4 is, is equal to 2 okay so he will take total two hours to eat this pile now when it comes to 7 as 7 modulo k if you look very clearly it is, is equal to 3 and 7 divided by k k is, is equal to 4 here so 7 by k is 1 okay so 1 hour he will take to eat those 4 bananas and remaining the 3 bananas he will take only 1 hour so again number of hours take to eat this pile is 2 now when he will come to 11 when he will come to 11 as you can see 11 modulo 4 is again 3 now 11 divided by 4 is 2 so 2 hours he is taking to eat 8 bananas and remaining 3 bananas he will take only 1 hour ok so 2 plus 1 will be equal to 3 ok so the num total number of hours which is required to eat all these piles of bananas will be equal to 8 which is less than equal to this our number of hours given so 
our answer will be in this case it will be equal to 4 okay so in this way we are coming to the answer now let's come to this example 30 11 23 4 20 now you can use uh, any numbers from 1 to infinity and check the number of hours uh, taken to eat all these bananas is less than or equal to 5 or not i am only showing the answer is uh, the answer present in uh, this case is 30 so we will see if the number of hours taking to eat all these uh, bananas is less than or equal to 5 or not okay so the given array is 30 11 23 4 20 when e is present in this pile now 30 is k equal to 30 here okay so 30 is less than or equal to 30 so he will take only one hour to it 11 is less than or equal to 30 he will take again on one hour again in this one again this one again this one so he will take only five hours to it okay and which is less than or equal to number of hours given let's suppose if we choose k equal to 31 okay so in case of 31 you should this all will be one okay all will be one and again in this case also five hours but we have to return the minimum okay let's suppose we choose k equal to 29 now if you note 30 is greater than 29 okay so again we, we will do here 30 by 29 plus 1 and 30 by 29 what it gives 1 so in this case he is requiring 2 hours okay to eat this first pile of bananas and also 11 by 29 he, again this one again this one again this one again this one so number of hours taken here is 6 hours which is greater than the number of hours given so our answer will be here 30 now we will approach so now we will discuss how to do this problem okay see one boot force is you can run a loop from 1 to sorry you can run a loop from 1 to infinite okay 1 to infinite means int max int max and uh, in uh, every case uh, in this uh, is the range from k okay so for k equal to 1 to int max you will check that uh, if the number of hours taken is less than equal to 5 so it will give you a huge tle okay huge tle so what you can do is not tle the time complexity here is required see uh, the what you can uh, what i can uh, tell is okay okay so it will give tne because uh, the time complexity is uh, greater than n square okay so it will run up to int max int max into and again here you will run a for loop to calculate the time taken okay so int max into n which is greater than n square so obviously it will give a tle okay now we will discuss how to do actually this problem So, see, now what is the maximum, uh, see we will run, a, uh, so the approach we will do here is binary search, okay, the approach, uh, the concept that we are going to solve this problem is binary search, okay, binary search, okay what we can do is see the number of bananas minimum minimum number of bananas eaten in an hour is equal to zero equal to zero but uh, for uh, uh, for the sake of simplicity we will take the minimum number of bananas minimum number of bananas bananas eaten in an hour we are taking this as one okay this is an assumption and what can be the maximum number of bananas maximum number of bananas he can eat 
let's suppose the uh, person that is eating the bananas is not a human but a robot he can eat infinite infinite number of bananas he can eat per hour but 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 for the uh, for keeping the problem state the maximum number of bananas he can eat is all these bananas okay all these bananas so maximum number of bananas will be equal to sum of the bananas present in the present in the vector present in the vector okay so let's use this example so 3 plus 6 9 9 plus 11 20 27 so maximum number of bananas is given 27 so we will so let's uh, give this name as left and give this name as right so why left is less than right okay left is less than right and we calculate the mid mid is, is equal to left plus right by 2 okay right by 2 and we will call a function and passing the this uh, vector is named as piles okay so if function piles mid comma h so what this function will do it will calculate the number of hours to eat all the manners present in the piles given that the rate of eating bananas per hour is mid okay so if this condition fulfills we will decrease our right okay so right will be equal to mid else we will increase the rate so left will be equal to mid plus one and finally return the our answer okay so answer in this case will be right okay so now I hope you understand the problem okay now we will look upon the code so as you can see if we sum all the integers present in the piles there can be a case which in which it will overflow okay so to be safe side i am taking long long okay long long to store the sum of the banners present in the piles so ll left is equal to one okay so minimum value of eating the banners uh, minimum value of eating banners per hour is one and right i am initializing with zero and then i will run a for loop in the piles and then sum up and store the result in right okay now i will run a while loop okay so it is i am doing here binary search okay while left is less than equal to right just ln mid equal to left plus right minus left by 2 ok and if function of piles piles comma mid comma h then I will decrease the right and else i will increase my left and finally return the right so the remaining part of the program is to write the function carefully bool func vector int address of x int mid int h and i will initialize hours equal to zero which implies that the num total number of hours required to eat all the bananas okay so for int y in the uh, let's name this vector as v okay and index as the value in all those piles array okay so index v now if x modulo mean 
equal to equal to zero so hours plus equal to x by mid okay else hours plus equal to x by mid plus one and then finally we have to return if the hours time taken is less than equal to the h okay so now let's run the program so it is accepted now i will submit it okay so it is submitted and my final request to all your guys is please like this channel also share and also subscribe and also give me love okay so thank you